David here from History Hustle, coming at you from Bandar City, Bigger One, here in front of the Omar Ali Safudan Mosque here in Brunei. Brunei? Brunei? Yes, Brunei. It's a very small country on the island of Borneo. And in this video, a short history about Brunei. Not a lot is known about the early history of Brunei. There are legends, there are speculations. Probably the Brunei as we know this today was a part of the Sumatra Srivijaya Empire and probably became later part of the Javanese Mayapahit Empire. And probably it was once a part of the Chinese Song Dynasty. What we do know is that the very first Sultan was Muhammad Shah and he conversed to the Islam. We might think that his son succeeded him, but as the second Sultan, we think of Sultan Ahmad. And then there was also the influential Chinese Ong Sung Ping, whose daughter married with the second Sultan Ahmad. So in the 15th century, Brunei became a Muslim country. The Brunei Empire expanded and was on its largest in the 17th century, with territories all around Borneo and even on the Philippines. The empire was a talukasi, which means it's about maritime power. It had a very strong navy. However, during the 17th century, the empire came into decline, partially because of problems of succession, who had to become the new sultan, but also because of the arrival of the European powers. The Spanish took the Philippines and the Dutch and the British took Borneo. To avoid further decline, the Sultan of Brunei asked for help. And in 1888, Brunei became a British protectorate. 1929, oil was found in Brunei and the British start massively drilling for oil. And with that, Brunei became an interesting target for the Empire of Japan because the Japanese needed oil so desperately. The Japanese invaded and occupied Brunei at the end of 1941. The Sultanate could remain on his throne, but it was the Japanese that ruled the country. Brunei was liberated by Australian forces in 1945. In 1959, there was a new Brunei constitution and Brunei could now govern itself. However, it remained British. In 1962, the Brunei uprising took place. An uprising supported by the Indonesian government and oppressed by the British. In 1963, Brunei would align itself together with Malaya, Singapore, Sabah and Sarawak and form Malaysia. However, last minute Brunei stepped out of this. Obviously, the Sultan of Brunei had no interest in spreading his wealth among the rest of Malaysia. And in 1984, Brunei became independent of Great Britain. The Brunei Sultanate is one of the richest people on the planet. However, Sharia law was applied in 2014. On the other side, the Brunei people don't have to pay taxes and get free education and healthcare.